Time to try 13 different monster energy drinks. Now, before we get started, let me just put a pin in it. No, I am not going to be drinking 13 full monster energy drinks in one sitting. Oh no, your heart's going to explode, blah, 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 blah. I will be taking one or two sips from each one. It, will, it won't even be a full can. Maybe. First off, uh, I mean, I'm not really a monster energy drinker at all. I don't really drink energy drinks because I'm not in middle school. So uh, let's start with the first one. This is just monster energy. It's fine. I, it's just, I describe it as like Flintstones vitamins crushed up into a juice. So I don't, I don't like love it. I don't hate it. It's okay. It is what it is. B minus. Next up, low carb monster. I like the color. I think it tastes perfectly fine. Um, comparing it side by side, 200 less calories, a lot less sugar. Oh my god, 108% in a can of Monster, sugar-wise. I think this is even slightly better because it's less sweet. This is the B. Yeah, I would, I would drink this and notice no difference. Okay, this is White Pineapple. Okay. It's bragging that it has no juice or anything real. Just chemicals. Just the chemicals you need. Okay. This is honestly a step up because it actually tastes like something besides Flintstones. B plus. It tastes like something. Let's give it a let's give it a point for taste. Tart. It's got a pineapple flavor. That's about it. Here we got watermelon. I like watermelon. Okay. Not this watermelon. Take a sour watermelon candy. Kind of like you know leave it in your pocket for like a month and then you take it out and then you're like, oh, I'll try it. And you have it always a little bit of dust in there. B, I guess. These next ones are, they have juice in them. This is Pipeline Punch. Let's see if the juice make this any better. Yes, considerably, my God, okay. It's like a, you know, like a fruity pineapple-y punch flavor. Pretty good, actually. It's always gonna have that slight vitamin-y, slightly bitter edge, but that's not necessarily a bad thing when the flavor is actually pretty good. So I'm gonna say A minus. I I like it. I yeah, inoffensive. Papillon. What the hell is that? Peach and nectarine. Oh, it means butterfly. I hope this tastes like butterfly. Also good. You have that tangy peach flavor. Thing is, these are, very, these are very cloyingly sweet. But I think, out of what I've had so far on the monster scale, I do think this is the best one. I'm going to give this an A. But the fact that it's a little too sweet, a little too sour, doesn't. I, I can't give anything an S yet. Mango Loco. If you're a faithful viewer of these videos, you, videos, videos you'll know I'm not um, a big mango guy. But... Let's see if this makes you go loco for mango. No. However, if you like mango, I think you will like this a lot. I don't, so, but I'm actually impressed that it pretty strongly tastes of mango. So for me, this is going to be like a B. But I think if you liked mango, this would be like A+. Plus. The next batch are all, all uh, zero sugar. And I guess they're like called Ultra. This one's Zero Ultra. So, okay. Yeah, it's just a very tame monster. It's just, if you want less of that vitamin-y flavor, just, just, it's just a way less sweet version. That to me is a plus. So this is still also like a B. I would rather not taste the monster because I don't think monster tastes that good. Here's Ultra Sunrise. That doesn't describe flavor. Will it taste like the sun? 
Oh, that just tastes like sun-kissed. Like, slightly more bitter, but yeah, that's sun-kissed. I like sun- if, if those of you who don't know what sun-kissed is, it's an orange soda. A caffeinated orange soda. I like it. I'm gonna say A. I like orange soda. Uh, this tastes just kind of like a okay orange soda. Ultra Paradise. I looked it up, it's like kiwi, lime, and cucumber. I don't taste cucumber at all. Lime, I can, I can, there's that sourness. Pretty good, again, still, some of these are so cloyingly sweet. It's like, it's like pouring fucking like, like candy powder down your throat. It's too much, but um, flavor's actually pretty good. But the sweetness, I'm gonna say B plus. Like, I think it tastes good. I just wish it wasn't so fucking sweet. And that's the zero sugar one. Ultra Fiesta Mango. I can already predict. I'm gonna be like, yeah, it tastes like mango. This is this is like mango lovers uh, commenting on my on this video. He's gonna, you know what he's gonna say? He's gonna say it tastes like mango and so I don't like it. Man, what an idiot. Also zero sugar. This is, the best way to describe this is like, if you put a mango on your tongue and then take it away, immediately. Like, it's a pretty, like it, do, it does not stick around for very long. Wouldn't that be a good thing for you? Um, you're not wrong. Although, if I'm gonna have something, I'd rather have it have flavor. I think for me, it's like a B. I don't hate it. These last two are concerning. Coffee, it's Monster 300 Triple Shot Mocha. Oh boy. Okay. That is not what I thought that would be like at all. It's it's coffee with cream in it and shape but it's still watery. Pretty mild. I thought it was gonna be like in your face sweet or Super, I don't know, just disgusting. Like, oh, it's monster energy drink with coffee, but it just kind of tastes like a very mild coffee. Now, I'm sure there's a ton of caffeine in that bitch, but I'm not gonna be drinking the whole thing because it says like 300 milligrams, three times the shot. But it's flavor, yeah. It's just kind of like like one of those Starbucks drinks you get in like a bottle. You can buy like the grocery store. Maybe even less sweet than that. I don't hate that. Uh, B plus? I, again, I, I thought it was gonna be gross, but it was just kind of mild. And then we have Mean Bean. This is also coffee and energy. These have milk in them. That's interesting. So they actually say to shake them. Kind of nice, actually. <laughs> this one has almost like, um, like a caramelly, like, sweetness. Still mild though, um, not cloyingly sweet. Or if you didn't tell me these were monster related, I would never associate them. I would just think, oh, it's like a, it's like a pack, you know, like a coffee drink you just buy and it, just regular coffee from Starbucks or something. I like this. Maybe just because I'm used to, you know, disgusting candy powder being shoved down my throat, but this is actually very. It's still mild, but it, it, it's tasty. It actually has like a nice caramelly, creamy, nice flavor. Yeah, I'll say, uh, I'll say A+. Okay, uh, that was Monster Energy Drink. Out of the, out of the ones there, I would actually drink this or this if I had to pick up one up again. Otherwise, I would go with the juice ones, but overall, this has not, this has not convinced me to become a monster devotee. I think that time has passed. Again, I'm not in middle school anymore. Time to go do the, the Kill Bill walk and have my heart explode. Bye.